What's up, everybody? It's the homie Truth Teller, the street reporter. We didn't all set with the news about Lil J. The story didn't been broken. A lot of people didn't spoke on it. Now we dealing with the aftermath. You know, his cousin slash manager, Rockstar Harry J, said he believed Lil J could be locked up no longer than a week. Then he said no longer than two weeks. Then he said no longer than three weeks. You know, so it kind of seemed like, you know, they wishing for the best. But I'm not going to lie, you know, Lil J just came home from a murder case and that, you know, he has uh, a lot of shit going on, man. You know, he's a gang member to how the police try to allege him and put him out to be. He done been shot several times. His name has been in the headlines. So to just guarantee that they just going to give him a slap on the back and say go home in a couple weeks. That's not a guaranteed fact, you know. Um, but I would hope something like that happened. You know, I don't think this was in God's plan, in my, in, in, in my opinion. You know, I think this just happened so fast. Things happen. We still don't got all the information, even though I've been getting reports and screenshots and neighbors been sending me things. I just think it's a travesty, though, because this guy was on his way up out of here. You know, I believe a big time major deal was coming for Lil J. He was doing the independent. He was fucking with Create Music. He was learning how to get the bag. He was doing the skits and all kind of shit. So it seemed like he was branding himself. This kind of slowed him down. But I'm not going to lie. It's a lot of things that have happened since he's been released from jail. Now, he got to go walk back in those prisons because I was heard he was sent to a prison. Uh, I guess that's how I do it when you kind of like violate a parole or something like that. So, you know, it's a lot of shit that he said. He's going to have to go in there and stand on it now. You know, he got released from jail. Then he went to dissing people in songs, dissing dead people and all kind of shit. So... He going to be back in there. He going to have to stand on a lot of shit that he was seeing and stuff like that. You know, you think he was famous when he went in there. Now he got out. He done did 40, 50 more views since he done been out. So he's even bigger than he was when he first got put up in there. So it's a possibility it could be a target on Lil J back in there. But, you know, Lil J, he the Wolverine. He known for the fighting and shit. So I think Lil J going to make it up out of this. I do believe that. Something about this seems a little weird, though. Kind of feel like maybe the police were on some bullshit with him. Who knows? But I do want to say, you know, it's crazy. You see people on the internet laughing about it. You see people that's absolute J kind of cracking jokes about it. A lot of people posting how they disappointed in him and shit like that. You know, it was a lot of people that was on this King Lil J wave. You know, and I'm not going to lie, King Lil J did disappoint a lot of the fans who really liked him and loved him a lot, you know. That's why you see all these blogs about it, people uploading his new interviews and shit just because he got locked up and they know that his name is trending on YouTube. So, the guy got a lot of clout, got a lot of power. Hopefully, when he come home this time, he tighten up that security, watch where he go. Because another thing that concerned me, I want to be honest with you, is these DMs I was getting, the screenshots of Lil J and stuff like that. I want to be honest with you. I'm not sure if Lil J knew, but... People in that neighborhood knew who you was, bro. They knew where you were going. They knew the houses you were walking in. Think you got to be a little more careful with that little J, you know. Maybe put that bass up a little bit more. Make sure that hoodie on and the hat down a little bit more so people don't recognize you. Because the DMs I got, I'm not sure if you knew. But it was a lot of people knew that you were coming to that block. I find that dangerous. I'm going to keep you updated on this. I get any more information. But you got to subscribe to my YouTube channel. Tell me the truth, tell us report.